Why, when you talk to a marketing agency, do they always talk about operations and the things that you can control? I'm gonna tell you exactly why. So we track all of our clients' phone calls, we listen to them, we also use some AI technology to understand what is being done on every single call. Is it bookable? Is it an actual lead? These are things that are really important for us to understand. So our data for the first seven months of 2024 shows us that of all leads that come in, we're just gonna use the number 100. So out of every 100 phone calls come in about 44% of those are qualified leads. So that means 44 out of every 100 are qualified leads. From there, the next step down is to determine how many are booked. And of those across our entire client set of over 100 clients, only about 52% of those jobs are being booked. So we're just going to use the number 50%. That means only 22 jobs got booked out of every 100 calls that came in. Now, we don't have a lot of data set when it comes to technician conversion data, uh, job cancellations, but let's assume 70%. So you go out to a job site, your text converts 70% of those 22 jobs. That leaves about 15 paying jobs out of every 100 touch points or every 100 calls. And it is so crucial. If you look at all of that additional opportunity that is just sitting there, it's untapped. Those are the things that instead of focusing on all these shiny objects and these new tools, if you just focus on the basics, if you just focus on booking more of those calls and then having your team when they come out on site to convert more of those jobs, and then you could focus on following up with anything that is not closed. If you fill the buckets or the holes in your lead bucket, if you will, you are gonna be much more successful. The biggest difference between our clients that get 70 to 80 X return on our service Services versus the ones that get a 5x, essentially it's the operations. It all comes back to operations. So that is what you can control. That is what I would focus on. Put all of your effort into that. If you are not an operations minded person, I would hire someone and focus on one of your biggest hires on finding someone who is an operations superstar.